OS X Mavericks, the 10th version of OS X to be released, brings new features and improvements to the OS that aren't groundbreaking, but are very welcome nonetheless. Let's take a look at what Mavericks offers. After first debuting in 2010 on the original iPad, iBooks has made its way to the Mac. Overall, it's pretty much what you'd expect. Instead of managing your book purchases in iTunes, iBooks now handles the heavy lifting and offers you a thumbnail library of all of your books, which you can read just like you can on iOS. Also included is the iBooks store, where you can browse and purchase the collection of free and paid books. Maps on OS X is functionally and visually similar to the Maps application that Apple debuted last year on iOS 6. Using Apple's in-house map data, the application offers a 3D flyover view, location bookmarks, directions, and the new ability to send directions from your Mac to your iPhone with the click of a button. The Finder in OS X Mavericks has received quite a bit of attention, adding new features like tags, which are reminiscent of labels and now work in any application, as well as with search. Tab browsing in the Finder is also now possible, allowing you to quickly switch between folders without juggling multiple windows. Tab support has also enabled Apple to introduce full screen mode to the Finder. Perhaps one of the most useful new features in Mavericks is the ability to reply to emails and iMessages directly from the notification banners that fly out when you get an incoming message. Not only does this save time, it avoids the hassle of app switching. Notification support has also been added to your Mac's lock screen, allowing notifications to stack up like they do on iOS, and websites can now deliver their own native notifications. Productivity people will appreciate OS X Maverick's improved multiple display support, which now allows independent full screen spaces across monitors. Separate menu bars have also been added to each display, and you can now move the dock to your active monitor. Safari in Mavericks has received some minor updates that improve its ease of use. First of all, you'll find a new, streamlined bookmark sidebar, as well as a shared links panel that shows links from people you follow on social networks. Last but not least, Top Sites has been redesigned to remove the 3D effect in favor of a plain thumbnail grid of your sites. Finally, iCloud Keychain is a brand new feature to both OS X Mavericks and iOS 7, allowing you to save your passwords and private information to iCloud, where it is synced across all of your devices. For security, enabling it requires you to enter extra authentication. While Mavericks can be thought of as a modest release of OS X, it includes a lot of features users have been asking for for years, and is another great iteration on the base that is OS X.